So this is 406 First Street. Got uh, sidewalks both sides of the road. Nice front porch. Fully fenced backyard. You walk in, it's the main living area here. Back to the kitchen. Off the kitchen is a powder room. A hole in the ceiling there. Nope. Back porch with a dog. I don't want to mess with them. Fully fenced yard. There's parking in the back as well, which is nice for the tenants. Got one bedroom here on the first floor. Looks like it's a converted dining room. Head up. There's another bedroom here. Looks like it's just mostly cosmetic. Like the floors need to be refinished. Good coat of paint on these uh, wood panel walls will make a world of difference. Got a full bath here. This room needs some work, but it's not terrible. It's all pretty simple stuff here. Paint, a little bit of drywall. Fourth bedroom up. So you have four beds up here and a full bath. You've got the bedroom downstairs. So you got five bedrooms. Plus this attic space. It looks like someone was living up here too. Looks like two people were living up here. down to the basement. Hot water tank is pretty new. Furnace is probably about 15 years old or so. Laundry down here. There's some water. Looks like it's leaking out of this uh, sink here. It doesn't look like it's coming from the outside. It's got a leaky, uh, leaky utility sink there. It's your electric. <clears throat> but yeah, not a bad house. I mean, it needs some work. It's all cosmetic though. And uh, you could rent it as a five bedroom, which is nice. You can get some nice rents here. So I think it's definitely one to consider, Mark, but I'll wait to hear back from you. Thanks.